Wednesday, the 27th of January, 2021, is the last day of construction on Trump's border wall. He's completed over 450 miles of this 30 foot tall, no climb fence in strategic areas all around the southern border. But right here in New Mexico, it stops and we have an uh, open border with just anti-vehicle barrier. And the problem here is that the wall stops there. There's a big gap and it picks up on the other side. This gap now becomes a funnel for anybody who wants to enter the United States illegally. That's unfortunate because this problem could easily be remedied. The steel bollards needed to fill this gap are already bought and paid for, stacked nearby and ready to be installed. But Biden's order to halt construction means these fence panels may never get installed. And one construction worker told us he believes they will simply be abandoned, left in the desert to rust away. CBN News reached out to one of the largest contractors that was working on this project and were told the stop work order will immediately cost over 5,000 construction jobs while the government tries to decide how to proceed. These contracts have already been awarded, so it may actually cost more for the Biden administration to halt construction than it would to simply allow these panels to be put to use. CBN also asked the Army Corps of Engineers for comment, but has yet to receive a reply. But that's not all. A few miles away, this construction yard holds more than 3,000 already completed wall panels, which works out to more than six and a half miles of fence that could be stopping drug smugglers and human traffickers from entering this country. Instead, it's likely these hundreds of tons of purpose-built steel will never be put to use, at least not under a Biden administration. From Columbus, New Mexico, I'm Chuck Holton for CBN News.